Hey y'all, welcome to Working Those Cues. I'm here with a CVS haul um, from today. And I'm also going to go ahead and throw in my Walgreens haul. It's not much, so I can put them together for you. So, I had a very small day today. I'm going to do a lot tomorrow. I just didn't have the energy today for some reason. But anywho, um, here we go. So what I did today was the Tina pads, which were um, on sale for $3.79, and I had a dollar off coupon. I don't know where it came from. I think I got it. It's a printable, I know. I don't know if I got it straight from the Tina website. I usually just go to Crazy Coupon Lady and go down her list and find whatever I need, but I think that's where it came from, the Tina website. Um, so I did that, and of course you know that you get $3 back, so it was a little bit of a money maker, a couple of cents. So, paid $2.79, got $3 back for the pads. I also did the Physician's Formula. I picked up the MAC Collection um, Quad Eyeshadow. Um, that was $7.49. So... Whenever I got to CVS and I scanned my card at the red box, um, I had a 4 off of 12 for cosmetics. So I went ahead and picked up this CoverGirl powder, compressed, uh, pressed powder. It looks like it's my color. And I thought it was really pretty. And it was 50% off. So along with the Physician's Formula and that, I made my, um, my $12.00. So what I did was, this is how my receipt looked, guys. Um, the powder was $4.25. I saved $4.24 on it. The pads were $3.75. I saved $3.10 on it initially. And then the Physician's Formula was $7.49. I went in with a $10 extra buck. I got the four off of 12 from the red box machine and the dollar for the Tina pads. I paid a total of 53 cents for the subtotal. Tax was $1.44, so total was $1.97. And of course, you know, you got your $7 back from the physician's formula and I got the $3 back from the pads. So, a money maker. Um, so that was cool and everything but I'm so upset with CVS and maybe someone out there in coupon land can help me with that I have called them I don't know what's going on all these people talking about 20 they getting a 20% off and a 25% off and 5 off of 30 I have not received any of that in like maybe a month or two the last thing I received was $5 off of 15 and I haven't received anything since then I don't know what's going on with them I will be calling again because I talked to the young man a couple of days ago and he said to check my spam I checked my spam nothing was there and he was like oh it's gonna be there but you can't use it until Monday and I don't know what he was talking about but I will be calling tomorrow asking to speak to someone above him or whatever because I am very frustrated with CVS I shopped there too much for me not to be able to get in on the deals he verified everything they have the correct email address on file I don't understand, but they need to get it together. So, anywho, on to my Walgreens haul. I did the fish oil today. I went in with a $2 register reward um, from my Cottonelle. Um, and I also went in with my vitamin book coupon the two dollars off in here the new coupon book go pick it up if you have it um so there was two dollars off in the fish oil was seven dollars and get seven back in register rewards they had a two dollar off coupon in the vitamin book so i used that along with um along with my two dollar register reward from the cotton yesterday 
and I had to go ahead and throw it in a filler because I was using the coupon from the book and the register reward. I got a 25 cent wet and wild eyeshadow. So that was my filler. So let's see. I paid focus. I paid three dollars and ninety cents after coupons and a register reward and I got back seven dollars so that was a money maker for me and I haven't decided what I'm gonna do with those seven dollars so anyway guys just wanted to come to you um, with my Walgreens and CVS haul for today. I'll probably have more tomorrow when I'm I feel a little bit better. So thanks guys and leave any questions or comments in the comment box below. Um uh, please give me some answers if you've ever had this problem with CVS. And thanks for watching, guys. Y'all have a good night. Bye bye.